Today in Tech Talk 101 SD. How hackers are targeting your phone via Bluetooth. Bluetooth is an amazingly useful wireless technology built into almost every smartphone, tablet, and laptop. We can use it to transfer files, play audio wirelessly, collect health data from wearable trackers, and more. Bluetooth is being targeted by hackers as a way to break into your devices and steal personal data. Because it is so useful, most of us keep Wi-Fi and Bluetooth enabled on our devices all the time. However, this could be making us potential targets of blue bugging, a technique to attack your device through Bluetooth. For modern-day user we can't live without our smart devices like smart watch, earbuds, and other smart devices. Most of these devices need Bluetooth connection to work. How does Bluetooth hacking work? Hackers use specialized software and hardware which automatically detects nearby devices equipped with Bluetooth. They can also see which networks your device has previously connected to. This is important because your phone treats these networks as trusted and will connect to them automatically in future. If the cybercriminals can replicate a trusted network, they can trick your device into connecting to Wi-Fi and Bluetooth devices that they control. The hackers can then bombard your device with malware, spy on you, and even steal your data from your text messages and apps. What else could happen? Once a smartphone has been compromised, the hacker can intercept and redirect phone calls, access bank details, send or receive files or simply watch what you are doing in real time, use your phone as they like. What is blue bugging? Blue bugging is a form of Bluetooth attack often caused by a lack of awareness. It was developed after the onset of bluejacking and blue snarfing. Similar to blue snarfing, blue bugging accesses and uses all phone FEATURES1, but is limited by the transmitting power of Class II Bluetooth radios, normally capping its range at 10-15 meters. However, the operational range can be increased with the use of a directional antenna. Where can this occur? Blue bugging is often performed in busy public places, often where there are a lot of routine commuters. Choosing a busy place allows them to remain undetected and to monitor the same devices which pass by regularly. Hackers may also choose places where people linger for several hours like cafes, pubs and restaurants. What can you do to keep safe? First, disable Bluetooth on your devices whenever it is not in use. Second, disable file sharing services that rely on Bluetooth like AirDrop or FastShare unless you are sending or receiving files from a trusted friend. Limiting access to Bluetooth services makes it much harder, if not impossible, to be a victim of blue bugging. Finally, ensure you have an anti-malware app installed on your smartphone, tablet and Bluetooth-enabled computers. In the event that a hacker does try to break into your device, the anti-malware app will detect and block suspicious activity, protecting your privacy and personal data. Fortunately, blue bugging attacks are still not very common, but that could quickly change.